Hello and welcome to the Dietrich Gamecast. Uh, we're back here again for another installment. I'm Jeremy, joined by Jesse. Hello. Jorge. Hello. Joseph. Hello. And for his first appearance since 2013, Asher. Hey. Uh, you may know him from other series on the uh, YouTube channel. Sims. WWE. Street Fighter. Street, streets Ahead Fighter. Streets Ahead <laughs> Fighter. Uh, Monopoly, I was pretty good at that. Oh, yeah. That was a big one. I rage quit, quit it. It was awesome. Yeah, that no, doesn't sound like you at all. <laughs> That's a crazy one. So we've got another uh, round of Around the Horn. Was that really necessary? No, that's what he does every time. <laughs> okay. We haven't, made, we haven't made the little musical cues yet. It's, yeah, it, we're working it, on that. Every single time he does it, it gets louder. Yeah. Uh, Jesse. Hello, we good are sir. Farthest far away from the horn, so you can start. All right. Well, uh, as for games played uh, in the in the past week, uh, Jeremy and I have been uh, have been going around playing some GTA Online. He is better than me in every way. It's been a good time, though. Um, yeah, I've had a re- I've had an absolutely great time playing it with you, sir. Uh, I enjoy races the most, obviously. Um, Otherwise, I've been dabbling in NHL here and there. I've been playing a bit of uh, Last of Us Remastered. Um, I don't remember why. I think I was just like, I feel like playing this game. And then I did. Um, So yeah, as for that. Um, As for non-gaming news, my thumb is close to healed. Can you show the people? I don't remember. Oh, I can't How many thumbs, thumbs up would you give it? I'd give it one swollen thumbs up. Last week we showed his gruesome injury, but now oh, you blur it out. No. Nope. Oh, it looks better. It's still it's a little swollen compared to the other thumb. Still. Oh my goodness. Um, That's gonna be an issue for your hand model. But uh, it was doing real well, and then I played my first ever game of volleyball, of like organized volleyball, not in gym class. Um, and note to all you out there, if you ever have a hand injury, playing volleyball is probably the worst game that you could possibly play. Hot tip. Um, I'm also not very good at volleyball. What about the one with where you hit the, your, the knife through your fingers? Oh, Knifey Spoony? Is that the name? No, that's a Simpsons reference. Oh. <laughs> I was going to say, that's a pretty bad name for it. It's a pretty cool thing. That's not a knife. This is a knife. Uh, that's a spoon. Ah, I see you've played Knifey Spoony before. Um, What's it actually called, though? Uh, don't don't stab your hands. No, there's an actual name for it. Do you want me to look it up? No, I think we need to brainstorm. Or hey, ideas. Okay. Oh, no. Have a knife day. Knife to meet you. Oh, that's. I did the same. That was just my joke. Yeah, yeah, but my joke better. normally I have like a big kitchen knife in my hand and I'm just waving it at them. It's Ow! Really funny. I hit myself in the eye. <laughs> I don't think that was a very good brainstorming session. Uh, how about, um... Yeah, I have one issue with... knife! I have one issue with our D- GTA sessions. Yeah. It's that, um, uh, you don't have a headset. <laughs> I don't. Oh. So I have to type to you on Facebook you while just, I'm playing. Why don't you just call? I don't like talking late at night. What? <laughs> I'm too loud. I'm too loud of a person. Also, he plays the game on mute. What? So when I put it on funny songs on the radio... He doesn't hear them. How could you play on mute? Because I listen to my own things instead of the things that the game recommends me. Have you ever heard of Spotify? Yeah. I'm not bad. I finished third. Also, can't you do Spotify for the PS4 so that keeps the game audio and balances them? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's the thing. No, but I could just not do that. And then I wouldn't have to have background music when the Spotify is on. What if I see a funny billboard? Point it out. You turn the music off. But then the I have to do like Facebook, and then it takes you two minutes to read it, and then we're twenty miles away. I pretty much read it right away. Also, would you just say "Ha, that's a funny billboard," and then you <laughs> have to turn and look at it? That sounds. Much but then you'd have a good laugh looking at it. If I don't play it on mute, will I still hear you talk through the headset? Yeah, but I don't want to talk to you unless you can talk back. No. Take me to get a headset then. If you take me to get a headset, I'll buy a headset. I'll but you're buying it. Yeah. You just have to. You just have to go with okay, it. We'll go to the store. Jorge will buy a PS4. You buy a headset. When you when you guys play that game, <laughs> when you guys play that game, do you guys challenge the law? Oh, we do. Challenge yeah, the law. Yeah. We did a couple of robberies. Oh, oh okay. With That's a semi truck. What's the name of the game, Joseph? Grand Theft Auto. Oh, you struck me. <laughs> oh. Okay. Would any of you play Grand Theft Auto Nanaimo? 
Like, do you think there's an interest for this new game? Sorry. Nobody's even heard of Nanaimo watching this. Do you know that Nanaimo <laughs> has, like, the most... Nanaimo bars? Like, used needles per square meter in all of Canada. Yeah. Mm. But good chocolate. Yeah, <laughs> really good chocolate. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't eat anymore. I've also stopped eating chocolate. That's my other piece of news. So. Day day 14. It kind of sucks. You're kind of wearing a cookies and cream shirt. But now you're Jeremy picked this shirt out for me. I did. But now you're eating oatmeal raisin, right? Nope. Don't eat oat. Don't just don't eat cookies. Period. How are you gonna eat your raisins? Uh, with raisin bran. Ugh. You, you. I hate raisins. You poor person. <laughs> wow. Okay, that's pretty uncalled for for raisin bran. Yeah, I know. I don't even He's like. I don't eat aggressive. I don't like raisin bran that much. He needs a cookie. You don't remember the show being this much of a bloodbath, do you? No, no. definitely not. Well, Speaking actually, of bloodbaths. <laughs> sure. What did you? <laughs> Okay, so I don't know what his story is. Uh, Jeremy told me I could do any story between now and the last time I was on the podcast. So I'm choosing something that happened a month ago. Nice. Uh, also, like it's a, like it was 2013, so I was kind of concerned there. Yeah. Uh, also, it's a also a bit of a hand injury. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, that's gnarly. Yeah, he's a, he's, he's a comedian first and foremost. <laughs> I try really hard. <laughs> Don't worry, we can all tell. <laughs> uh, so I sliced open my hand with a knife uh, in the middle of a final exam. It was sick. <laughs> uh, what, had, do you have statistics? Uh, no, we were having to brunoise onions. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's, for a you're, you're a brunoising fan? No, just for a final <laughs> exam to be cooking. Well, Patrick Brunois? Oh, yeah. I, saw, I saw you liked a uh, brunoise enthusiast. I thought he Facebook. was writing an exam and he just cut himself. <laughs> well, I'm in culinary school, so the exams are about food. Cool. Yeah, I keep okay. getting Snapchats from Joseph with brunoise filters on them. <laughs> <laughs> like, enough. I don't, <laughs> Dude, I don't have I get Snapchat. It. Hashtag brunoise. I don't have Snapchat, so it couldn't have happened. If you had Snapchat, Joseph, uh, what what sort of content would you, you be looking for? I don't know. Brunois. Enough about it. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right, Asher, you cut your hand open. Uh, You're bleeding profusely, I assume. Yeah, I got six stitches. Ooh, uh, you say that five times. Are you still fast. doing the exam? I, I had to do it a week after. I see. Passed it. Nice. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Passed it or passed out after all the blood loss? Passed it. Okay. No, wait, I, I passed I, it or, pa- or passed it or passed up. Passed up. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Huge adrenaline rush. I don't it think was you're fun. supposed to brunoise pasta. Yeah, I know. Joseph, you're the brunoise expert. Are you supposed to brunoise pasta? What does that even mean? <laughs> <laughs> Look at you playing. Uh, pasta is like flour, uh, egg, no, no, oil, no, no, water, brunoise. and then you just mix it together and make pasta. Can you mind yeah. brunoising? Uh, that wasn't anything. That was just me moving my hands. Also, okay, can you there's, no, there's no mind noise. <laughs> okay, Miming's the lowest form of comedy. Wait, wait, no, 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 I'll mime Brumois. Okay? Well, you're not an expert. My name's Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite thing. <laughs> I'm a mime. Asher, how do you spell Brunois? B R U N O I S E. What? Brunois. There's an E then? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Ha! I'm uh, 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 All you nerds in the chat, is that true? <laughs> nice. He goes back to the mic joke. <laughs> it doesn't land the first time. Boy, why are you going to land the Just double down, let's go. Yeah. Can't. <laughs> okay. I was uh, probably name this Brunois if I'm uh, motivated to look at the spelling. <laughs> Okay, wait, what was I telling you? What was I telling you? You got, you got six You got your gaming as well. Oh, 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 So then I went to a Melee tournament for Super Smash Brothers Melee. Uh-huh. Uh, but it's I couldn't... an ancient game. Yeah, uh, 15 years old. Uh, I couldn't actually use my left hand because if I'd move this finger or just open up the wound, then it would just bleed a lot. Nice. Uh, so me and my friend went together. I used my right hand on the controller. He used his left hand. And we're just trying to talk constantly, but we're also not good at talking without insulting the other person. So mostly we're just yelling. Am I the friend? <laughs> uh, there are others like you. I'm sorry. You still mean a lot to me, though. There are other sad Jewish kids? 
is a lot. <laughs> right. It's kind of our thing. Right here. Went 0 2, but had the time of my life. That seems illegal. Tournament wise, like, yeah. were you really allowed to bring a second person in to use the controller? Uh, we, like, we we talked to the TO, uh, the tournament organizer, and oh, he was Toronto. <laughs> he was fine with it, just because we really sucked with the two of us. Yeah. Like, just the one game we were us. close to taking two stocks. Uh, you start with four, so it was good. Jeremy, did you brew Brunois anything to add to the stock? Joseph, <laughs> did Asher Brune wine anything? Can you please mind Brune wine? Okay. <laughs> this uh, joke's still funny. Everyone in the chat, do you... <laughs> Welcome back. Can you bud. see my finger? <laughs> I, I have nothing anymore. Please, someone Can else Can you mind Brune wine? No! <laughs> do you do this? You know, it's something you do, you know? You just feel it. Yeah, you gotta feel the brunoise. Jeremy, isn't it your turn now? No. Well, I want to know what brunoise is. No. Because I was uh, pretending to know what it was before. <coughs> no, right. is, it, is it like caramelizing? Uh, no, no, it's when you... It's a cut. Uh, it's about half the size of your pinky nail. My pinky nail? Yeah. Like, size what? Depth? Uh, and it's a, it's a cube, but it's meant to be, like, that size, but cubed. <laughs> Yeah, a quarter of your pinky nail cubed. That was Jorge just okay. looked at me the maddest he's ever looked at me. <laughs> well, of course you would say that. You're an enthusiast. Do people actually watch this? Shh. Jeremy. <laughs> I'm going to tag this with Brunois <laughs> on YouTube, and then it's just going to blow up. Oh, it's like that group that's <laughs> that's tagged with fun. Wait, what's that one? What's the go Oh, yeah, we made a private group to plan us all going go-karting. Uh, but I put Rotini uh, <laughs> as the descriptor because that's what I was eating. And so now we get a bunch of uh, requests to join. I wonder everybody. if people could find Rotini that. enthusiasts? I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they could. Maybe it's it's a funnier funnier group. You can't fun join. Fetty. Maybe Fetty we talk about fun Fetty anymore. Fetty Wop? What about Tortelloni? Fun Fetty Wop. Hmm? Tortelloni. Tortelloni. I know that's a favorite of yours. Oh, no, Jorge. Tortellini's better. You prefer Tortellini? I do too, honestly. Yeah, then why'd you eat so much tortelloni? Because my mama makes it. <laughs> my mama makes a tortelloni, so I gotta eat it at the podcast. Because you're Italian, right? No, I, it's, other people can Slightly. eat tortelloni. <laughs> yeah, Jorge Gomez Jr. is not a really an Italian name. Yeah, but no, I'm not Jr. <laughs> I, I guess you could make the Jr. part Italian. I don't know what Jr. is in Italian. I don't know. Juniorelli. Junior. <laughs> Junior. Uh, okay. Asher, our uh, our linguistics expert. I'm the Italian expert. Oh, good. I can tell based on the way you said Italian. <laughs> Jeremy, what's your story so that Asher will stop talking? I purchased uh, Near Automata. Yeah. Which a uh, highly regarded game for 2017 that I wanted to check out. Put a few hours in. Seems pretty cool so far. Uh, good story. Some good characterization. Sort of a uh, hack and slash game but there are some different elements uh, i don't want to say too much because two of us here are doing a little bit of a, a playthrough who on the channel where are you an owl i don't know if they want to identify themselves what they don't <laughs> they would prefer being anonymous it's uh near anonymous it's team hand injury over here and I gotta say that first episode is ow, 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 my hand injury Something that real that special, that first episode Yeah um, but Special it, is a very, very nice way of saying if it If you're playing the game properly, it actually seems pretty cool So I've been enjoying it um, Don't give that, too much away I played a little Ticket to Ride online <gasps> TGRO? It's just called Ticket to Ride but, um, TGRO? I was being pretty devious in the one game I played. Yeah? I was doing some pretty serious blocking in the... Uh, it's a game where you connect cities by trains. It's like a board game, if you've never played it. I was doing a lot of blocking. And blocking is pretty contentious in the online Ticket to Ride community, judging by the chat bar on the side. Because <laughs> some people will think it's definitely not a part of the game. Others think it is. They have choice words for you? Not for me, just in general. Oh, okay. Uh, just in general. Uh, were there any pictures of moms with babies on this Ticket to Ride online forum? No, you can only choose... Av the only avatars available are, like, the pictures of the people from the box. And Zoe Saldana? Of Ticket to Ride. Zoe Deschanel? Nope. Zoe different, Deschanel different is not person. on the cover of Ticket to Ride. Woo! Woo! Trains! <laughs> <laughs> that's her. That's her. 
<laughs> Dude. It's like she was right here. <laughs> Who's your favorite Ticket to Ride character? Uh, there's the kid in the green. That's it, it depends. Like, if you're doing the European, black is by far uh, the yeah. best. But in the regular American edition, blue. Have you seen Hands the, down. Have you played the United Kingdom one? No, but I played Indian with you. Yeah. That's cool. Uh, United Kingdom just came out for the game. I'm kind of interested in that because apparently there's like a tech tree. Ooh. It's so kind of interesting. Yeah, Pot- you get pottery, yeah. and then once you get pottery, you can go to animal husbandry. Yeah. Or sailing. Unless you're playing as Jorge, then you can stare at pottery. Yeah. <laughs> you're like the Cree in Civilization Jorge's 6. Jorge's the only one of us who took the optional pottery course in our high school. In and boy, Audi, did he nail it. <laughs> you took pottery? I did. Jorge, what's your favorite thing you've made in pottery? You made, not you've made. That sounds more present tense than it should. Did I even make anything? Yeah, you did. Remember that? I have a picture on my... Actually, oh, I made like a tree trunk. I, actually, I have a picture on my computer that I took with my cell phone, with the cell phone that I had in high school of like a pumpkin thing, like a deep oh! pumpkin that you made. That was my... That was my... That's the only uh, thing I made. Away. Like the only <laughs> picture I have of anything to do with you on my computer and it's like, this dumb pumpkin you made in Pottery 12. My last project exquisite that was your thesis it's like half there's no top to it there is a top oh, there, was, there, there, there wasn't a top in the picture oh okay i might have taken it there was only a to top in my, there was only a top in my math class i oh. also played uh, mini metro oh i have that game i love that game i hadn't played in a while i was trying the washington dc map okay uh this is a game where you connect up cities with trains if yeah. you and another uh, one of those <laughs> it's, it's a little different it's more like it's it's different. Yes, I'm, I'm being uh, reductive. But um, it's more of a fast-paced game. And uh, I was doing pretty well until Asher showed up today. And I had to open the door. Or no, Joseph. It was yeah, Joseph. It was Sorry, Asher. I was late. Joseph's the I one who showed courteous. up on time. Anyway. I was close. Jorge showed up two hours late today. <laughs> tisk tisk. That's Ooh. why he's going last on Around the Horn, but uh, right now we got Joseph. So, since last we spoke, it wasn't a super busy week. Uh, <laughs> Sounds uh, pretty since dull. Spoke. But, uh... It's <laughs> so formal. <laughs> Let's see. Friday night, we played floor hockey. That was fun. That's true. I was there. Jeremy was there, too. Uh, near the end, we were playing. We were on the same team, and I shot you in the leg accidentally. So, it was two on one. Yeah. Like with a rifle, right? <laughs> no, with the ball. And Jeremy was really mad. Yeah, I don't think it was really the best play, given the circumstances. Yeah. Unless that being two on one. Yeah. <laughs> it was kind of funny, though. It hurt yesterday, I gotta say. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah. When and I was, let's see, I was what else? Wandering. So there was that. Oh, yeah, we, we pulled up that huge trade in, uh, four-way trade in fantasy, fantasy hockey. hockey. I traded away over half my roster. Yeah. That was Friday. pretty crazy. That's a part of history. I got Leon Dreisaitl, which pretty I'm pretty happy with. If yeah. anybody knows hockey, one of the better players. Yeah. To come out of Germany. Yeah. Uh, Thomas Vanek. He's better than Thomas Vanek. Probably, yeah. He's Austrian. Yeah, also. <laughs> Did he play for Germany, though? I don't know, but Dan Oh, what about Marcel Gott? Dan Heatley. There you go. Dan Heatley was born in Germany. Silent high five. Nope. That was not silent. No, I heard I it. Could hear it. Marco Sturm? Uh, okay. Yeah, we made some pretty serious deals. You yeah. got one veto. This is my favorite thing to do with hockey. Oh, yeah. I just yeah, say yeah, players yeah. that Joseph... Patrick Kane for Evander Kane, which yeah. is a really stupid trade. Hey, well, it was so good for much. me if it worked. Yeah, it would have been good for you. It would have been really bad for Gabe if no one vetoed yeah. it. You know what would be funny? If they didn't veto it, just to punish Gabe. <laughs> There's been a lot of dram- drama in our fancy album. Anyway, uh, uh, any, um, anything else? Well, also, Wait, can people even hear us if the microphone's all the way back there? You're... You're... Don't have words. Okay, so also, <laughs> the Flyers are now on a four-game winning streak. All right, Jorge, how have things been going? Whoa. <laughs> it's like it's like, like the news of the year. It's like watching you eat a piece of candy and then you throw it up and then you look at the ground and you go, "Oh, is that a piece of candy?" Is this something well, you have experience really with, fun. Jesse? No, I've never eaten things that I've thrown up, Jeremy. Okay. Besides, Mr. Highfalutin. What? Like a like a like an oboe? Can you start your thing? Yeah. <laughs> um, what did I do this week? 
Just chill. <laughs> just chill. Just, you know? just, just chill. I put I put my my new wheels on my car finally. Ooh. Uh, this is the Cressida Project car that you've had for a couple of years. Yeah. That you found in an alley filled with uh, animal Feces? excrement. Yes. And a bee's nest. They, well, I'm not sure nest. if it was an animal. Yeah. I mean, it was so, a living being. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Pibbin Jesse. Humans are animals. That's right, Jorge. I I remember us looking for that car. It was sort of near. On it. it was in Jesse's neighborhood. No, it was cl- it's closer to you, first of all. It's closer to everyone else that was on the <laughs> podcast at that time than it was to me. But more importantly, I remember you looking at that car saying, I'm going to go get it and being like, do I have a treat for him? I'm going to go break into this car at 3 a.m. so that Jorge gets a gets his just desserts. So, Jorge, I don't want to get too personal here. But, yeah. Uh, what what ballpark would you say is the investment so far on this car you got out of an alley? On a scale of too much to the uh, the amount you <laughs> you used. Too much. It's <laughs> like three grand. All right, all right. That's, that's actually grand. really good. What? No. Is the, is the car right? It's no. That's a lot less than oh. I thought it was, Jeremy. That's all. What did you think it was? Higher. That's more than I thought it was. I thought it was. Thirty-two hundred. But yeah, do you have spinning rims? No. Are you gonna get spinning sounds rims? like you're. Uh, do you want spinning Sounds rims? like you're making no. some progress now. Yeah, I got a new uh, clutch master cylinder. Yeah. Ooh. I gotta go pick it up from the states, though. Isn't that the guy from Teen Mutant Ninja Turtles? Yeah. Wow. So some cross cylinder. shop. Yeah, master cylinder. <laughs> <laughs> what? Cross border shopping. Yeah. What are you Oh, yeah. when you go, can you pick me up some kosher no. chocolate chips? I'll pay. I'll buy them you for you. You don't. You're not eating chocolate. Yeah, I know. I just couldn't think of anything that I could only get across the border, other than why kosher. Well, my gr- there was a huge thing with my aunt. Okay. And yeah, that's you it. must have really picky ants. Usually, ants lead anything. <laughs> only, <laughs> only if it's on a picnic ba- ba- basket. Blanket. I meant to say blanket, not basket, but I said blasket. Picnic basket. Oh, hey, boo boo. Uh, I don't think Park Rangers gonna like that very much, Yodes. You know, I have Yogi Bear, the animated film on 3D Blu-ray. The baseball play? No oh, way. got it for free. Oh, I remember that. Yeah. Did you get one? With Dan yeah. Aykroyd yeah. and Justin Timberlake? <laughs> yeah. Can I buy it from you? Sure, how much? You can also have mine. For free? Actually, what are you doing? I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I just I don't want to own do Yogi you know, Bear anymore. Do you know where that is? <laughs> no, I think my parents threw it, away, threw it out. There you go. The I'll, buy, I'll, buy yours, I'll buy yours for... Uh, a, a a lemonade. What you just said? Five bucks. I didn't say five bucks. You did. When did I say five bucks? Just now. Okay, I'll buy it for six bucks. All right, all right, and we're getting something going here. You guys? <laughs> I am not. Let's auction off Yogi Bear 3D. Asher, if you buy it for six bucks, I will buy it from you for a lemonade. It's a thirty-five dollar value. <laughs> Why? Are you still Why? Is it? Huh? Are you still speaking, Jorge? No. Okay. Oh, actually, I figured Jorge was done. Round two. I, I haven't done my 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 video game. Oh right, yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. Let's get back to gaming. Okay, uh, I was playing. Oh, yeah. I finally played Forza Seven on my new graphics card. Does it Very work? Nice. Yes, it runs smooth, yes. smooth as hell. What frame frame are you getting? Uh, Sixty. Yes. How's Hitman? Love it. I haven't I haven't played it. Just Forza. Just, just Forza. Pl- let's play Hitman together. Is Forza Seven it's good? Online. I've heard mixed. No, no, no. Yeah, I'll just come over and watch you play Hitman and tell you what to do. No, you can't tell me what to do. I'm a man. I can do it. <laughs> He's a man of hits. <laughs> yeah, you stole my joke. Jorge, uh, Forza Seven. Let's hear a little bit. More I like Jorge. It. I like Jorge stumbling to come. I want to be swayed. Words, I'm a man. <laughs> I'm a man, uh, sir. I'm like a tree in the breeze. I don't know. Need to be swayed. That's a, not that's all the cars. Good not all the cars are unlocked at the beginning. Okay. There's no Toyota. No, uh, not any Toyotas. You know what? I want to get five. You know what? Shut up. Oh. Not even a, not even a Prius or something. No, there's like only the, like the race cars. Like the Camry, NASCAR, the stock car. Oh, nice. And I think like a Toyota truck. Okay. So no, not really what you were looking for. No, 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 uh, no production. Toyotas. How long does it take to unlock cars? Because I know microtransactions, <laughs> there was a bit of talk about they were pretty harsh. Jorge actually bought this game when he was born. Well, and he just unlocked the first abil- his first ability to play. Yeah. But no, you have to like collect cars to unlock more Co- cars. What? I don't understand. Yeah, you'll understand when <laughs> you're older, buddy. You have to get money to make money. I think aren't cool, there like that was cool you collector did. levels you get? Yeah. To? So yeah. you have to like collect cards to unlock more. In the cards. first level, and then you yeah. can go to the second level. It's stupid. And the tracks are me. Just go back to i racing. Simpler. Yeah, no shit. Sure. You just buy each car for twelve bucks. Also, online, everyone's crashing into each other. 
Oh, I shouldn't be surprised, though. It's no, you that. shouldn't be surprised. Gran Turismo seemed like it was kind of trying to fix that, but it was also... It wasn't my favorite driving stuff. Mm-hmm. GT Online's good. Not that I've been doing that much driving anyway. GT Online. GT, GT Online? Online's GTA the, Online. It's the worst. Oh, for uh, as a racing game, it's quite bad. No, but it has a lot of... The, you do the, have a lot of driving uh, catch up. It's incredibly bad. The catch-up is the worst. I mean, I like it because usually I end up in 12th halfway I mean, through the race. It's just a different thing, right? Like, in GTA, the goal sort of to hover around the middle of the pack and then try and run people over at the end. Pit maneuver. No, I'm a clean racer. I don't do oh, that kind of Then you probably wouldn't enjoy it. Yeah. Oh, have I've you been... ever played Lego Racers? No. Oh, yeah. Wait, maybe. We should play through Lego Racers. Right. right at the start of one of me and Jesse's races, I just bend him right into traffic. <laughs> okay, yeah, I, 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 would, I would do that to Jesse. I wouldn't <laughs> do it to, like, normal people. Yeah, that's true. I'd do it to you. I don't think I ever pitted you. Well, you better step your game up. I don't... I'm a clean yes. racer. Stop listening to Spotify music. Exactly. You gotta hear the revs. You're Justin Bieber's. <laughs> is pitting only before the race starts? No. Pit, pit is just when you when hit, you hit like, the, the back, back end yeah, of the okay, car. Yeah, okay. Yeah. No, I'm a clean racer. I avoid people at all costs. Uh-huh. Except when we're in the air on motorbikes and I can push them off. Then it's funny to me. <laughs> uh, is that all you've played around? Yep. It's a good amount. What about Hitman games? Go? No. Hey man, go on the on the <laughs> yeah, iOS. I don't have PS4 that. now. Eh? What the Hey man, go? Yeah. Why? Uh, yeah, I don't really understand it. You either. should get a PS4. No. You <laughs> then you can play Hey man, go. <laughs> and GTA Online with us. But that would be good. You don't even talk though. You're too I... scared to talk at night. <laughs> there could be <laughs> undesirable people talking at night. Like club me. goers. Covered. Those yeah. dang club goers. Don't look at me. <laughs> I see you, Jorge. Jeremy, you're fine, not Jorge. Jorge's not supposed to make eye contact with me. That was part of my contract in coming back. Oh. Revenge. Make I didn't read your contract. They are. They are. Hey, what's up? Jorge's not supposed to look at me. <laughs> okay. Wow, that was a great first segment, guys. Thank you. Now it's time to move on. Are you ready? Yeah. To Battle of the News. <laughs> What is happening right now? You're not supposed well, to do it. He is. <laughs> I know, I segment, think of anything else, though. Uh, we each bring forward a piece of gaming news from the week, and uh, we argue <laughs> which one is the best. Okay. So since Jesse started around the horn, Jorge, you'll begin. Oh, no. Uh, battle of the news. Every time. Okay. New controller. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is better than the last controller. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, it's another, it's another this, Xbox is, this, this is going to become my new favorite inside joke every time. <laughs> so there's, it's it's called the Duke. Yeah. Yes. It's 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 bringing back the old school, X, the the original Xbox controller. It's the giant one that you yeah. can barely hold. Yeah, but uh, I don't know. It's new. Well, it's old, but <laughs> they're bringing it to Xbox One and PC. Yeah, but it and it's fifty dollars US. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why you'd want to play with the Duke. Know, because it was cool. really heavy and too big. Uh, no, no, because it's, because it's the Earl is out is of town. Lighter? Thank you. It's lighter now. Ooh. I read that. I read that. Wow. Ooh. Are you thinking of getting one? No. Ooh. It's still too big. But Wait, you did fits, research on this? It fits nicely in, no. in your palms. It, if it, your it palms are like this yeah, far apart. Hurt. No, the I Xbox One controller is too, <laughs> too like, jagged. Too angular? Yeah, There's one there if you want to show it off. Too anglefish? Joseph, is that your favorite kind of fish? It's better than yeah, so this is the Xbox controller. Not controller. Oh, there's something stuck to it. Oh, some packing. Yeah, see, it's so it's like small. You're not really showing the camera. You're more showing yourself. Look at this. <laughs> it looks pretty much the right size for you. No, your hands. no, you need a big it's like, one. It's like one of those infomercial <laughs> guys that like holds up a product that isn't bad. And he's like, that's gross, and like throws it <laughs> off screen. Does this controller just always slip through your hands? <laughs> 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 Try the new Duke. Only fifty dollars U.S. <laughs> The new controllers are just too jagged. Well, I gotta say, this is more interesting controller than your glow in the dark one last time. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Are you insulting Sea of Thieves? <laughs> sea of Thieves didn't even know yet. Why is it getting a control? <laughs> I don't know. What well, what game would do you want a controller for, Jeremy? Hmm. What would be your cool like branded? I'm controller? not big on the game specific controllers. I, I have the Uncharted one, but Wii it really looks like Uncharted. <laughs> Wii Sports. <laughs> Yeah, if I can get a controller for that. It's I, all about, um... I, uh... 
one two switch now. Okay. Everybody loves that. I wanted everybody's golf controller. Ooh. Everybody's golf is really good. I forgot to mention that. That's a great game. Even has fishing in it. That's for me. And that's a good segue into Joseph. Okay, so yeah. my piece of news here is that uh, there's the new Vive Pro 2018, which is the new. Uh, <laughs> It's the new, it's the new head mount. What HDM? What is it? HDM. Head mounted display. Yeah, head mounted display. That's right. And it's the best one yet, cause it has the best graphics. Um, pixel density. And the best pixel density so far. Joseph couldn't find it. It seemed like liked. it'd be fun. To, it seemed like it'd be fun, <laughs> but I mean, yeah. Virtually, at least a good time. Have you ever done? Nope. It's a good. Would time. you? Definitely worth. Maybe doing. yeah. Be fun. What would you like to would you like to be a fish being caught? There is VR fishing. Oh, oh. Uh-huh. whoa! That'd be cool. We should make VR fishing with Joseph, where you can be, it be Joseph. Hockey. <laughs> what about hockey? <laughs> Playing a fishing game. Anything where you move around quickly kind of makes you sick. So that might be tough. Oh, <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be funny. Anyway, Vive Pro looks really interesting. Uh, yeah, it'll be the most advanced headset on the market. I forgot to check. How much does it cost? They haven't announced the price yet. But um, I'd say one? under a thousand dollars, you'd be pretty lucky. Okay. We should get one. I probably won't get one. Go for it. You can get one. What would you buy first, a PS4 or a VR headset? VR headset. Yeah, that's what I thought. You can get the PSVR. How much is that? There Wait, was a deal on for. If you think about it, PSVR backwards is R R. Oh, it's R V S P, not R S P. Yeah, it could be pretty interesting. Because pixel density is a pretty key thing. Because on current VR headsets, it's kind of hard to read text. Because the pixel density isn't high enough. So on this one, they're saying you'll be able to read text perfectly clear. Oh, that's good. Which is good if you want to read a book in VR. I, I would like to be sitting in the ocean <laughs> reading the old man in the sea. I watched a YouTube video of somebody driving their car through the city in VR. And it was pretty good. Because it was a 360 video. So I could see who was behind them. Where is, was it you? Just driving behind them, holding your phone up, watching this <laughs> video of this person? Whoa. That's weird. Whoa. That thing you said. <laughs> it's really odd. It's that's kind of freaking with my don't, mind. Don't use my quotes against me. That's my, that's my cadence and tone and diction. So I have a piece of news. Okay, let's hear it. Detective Pikachu is on the case. Ooh. Uh, you may have seen it previously, the Detective Pikachu game came out in Japan, and they announced a movie starring Ryan Reynolds. What? Oh, yeah, I did hear about this. But now they're translating the game and bringing it to the States in March, and there's going to be an amiibo with it, which is the real news. Was it for the Switch? Um, no, it's for 3DS. Oh. Uh, but you know, normal ami- uh, amiibos are only like this big, right? This yes. one's double size. What? Which I don't know why, because Pikachu is experience. smaller than regular humans. <laughs> But there's going to be a huge Detective Pikachu amiibo. $30 US. But it's going to be really big, and it's going to unlock the ability to replay cutscenes in the game. Which is a thing that's already in all other games. But Detective Pikachu has a cool, deep voice. Maybe Jesse could learn from him. Because in faking it, really, he kept letting the culprit slip away into the dark. Well, that's true. You're when really we were ruining the illusion of, of recording things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that'll go up before this, I think. Uh, yeah, check out that video. Uh, but I really like Detective Pikachu. And I'm excited to see Ryan Reynolds take on the character. I don't know if I'll pick up a 3DS to play the game. Maybe. Maybe a 2DS. But, um... Oh, it's on any form of DS? What about well, no. What 2DS about, plays 3DS games. What about, four, in 2D. what about 4DS? Where you travel through time to play it. <laughs> well, you will have to, because it comes out in March of 2018. Now, Asher... It's your first appearance on Battle of the News. Okay. So I'm expecting big things. I'm not. I'm not freaking out at all. <sighs> okay. Good. Do I have news for you? You're supposed wait, to point at this. You. Guy. There you go. That's <laughs> better for the joke. <laughs> okay. No, no, nothing screams Asher more than forgetting a joke he made <laughs> five minutes earlier. I think that was like half an hour ago. <laughs> Doesn't matter. It was it was not long ago. It was not long enough ago. You're drilling his. Uh, okay, his I'm way too point. sober for this. Uh, <laughs> EA stocks today, January twelfth, have gone up by one point oh one percent. 
Uh, ATVI, uh, the Activision company, has gone up 1.62%, which is actually really good for the company because around from the 20th to the 27th, the stocks were going down a lot, and so people were worrying a bit. But especially with this Overwatch League and everything else going on, you're sure to see the stocks rise up. And Tencent uh, stocks, one of the big uh, companies, they own League of Legends, their Chinese company. Uh, they went down 0.18%, but still, uh, they're projected to still go up within 2018. That's great. Jesse, uh, what do you have to offer for Battle of the News? I knew what words you were saying there. <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you just started saying numbers, and I, I blanked out. It's uh, like, you know how some people listen to number stations to go to sleep? Yeah. Yeah, it's like that. Okay. That's why I was yawning. You, st- you, st- you stole my argument. <sighs> we'll get back to it. Um, my Do piece not. of news is a big piece of news and something that Asher offhandedly mentioned, but mine is about the Overwatch League. Yes. The, uh, the newest esports league to take the world by storm. And by the world, I mean the U.S. and, uh, one city in Europe and two cities in Asia. But, uh... What are the cities? Uh, I... It's... They're in Seoul. They're in Shanghai. They're in London. They have two teams in L.A. They have a team in Boston, a team in Dallas, a team in Houston, a team in Florida, and a team in New York. And Philadelphia. And this Ooh. is the first league to use the city-based team Yeah, model. exactly. That's the huge sports. thing about this. Is it's, it's not just, you know, companies. It's not like Cloud... Is it Cloud9? C9. Scott, what's the... What's the Cloud9 is one is a, big is esport team. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. I just couldn't remember if I was just thinking of a phrase I knew. But, like... You know, it's not just a company from Cloud9. It's, you know, actual cities and stuff like that. Um, I like the name Boston Uprising. That sounds kind of cool, actually, surprisingly. What's the Flyers name? I mean, the Philadelphia name. I think it's the Fusion, but I'm not 100% oh, yes. certain. The Fusion. Uh, Man Machine, the future. Um, but they're probably pretty bad if they're a Philadelphia team. Yeah. No. Just knowing other <laughs> Philadelphia teams. That's harsh. That's probably the best team there is. The Eagles? The Flyers. Yeah, no. Um, but anyway, I think that that's, that's pretty huge. That It seems like the, the next big step into eSports, excuse me, eSports becoming, you know, almost almost the same as regular non-eSports. Mm-hmm. What would you call non-eSports? Sports. IRL sports? <laughs> IRL sports went out of business a while ago. That's it's true. just IndyCar now. <laughs> okay, so we've heard our arguments. Whoa. <laughs> That was pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, what do we think is the uh, worst piece of news here? It's tough. There's a lot of good pieces. Who are you pointing at? I can't actually tell. Uh, Joseph no, or not. Jorge. Oh, yeah. I, I feel like they're the least animated for it. And Joseph's distance. argument for HTC Vive Pro was maybe not impassioned. Yeah, it's it's it not was. really a VR uh, advocate. But I think it is genuinely a pretty big piece of news. Yeah. Because it's going to change a lot about what VR can do. I'm sorry, I haven't been on this style of podcast before, so I don't know whether we're doing it on the cell or the actual piece of news. Um, both. Yeah. you, know, you got to consider altogether. everything. Whatever argument helps you win. Okay, Hori's product was dumb. Wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of just a bigger controller, but it is pretty funny to bring it back. This week wasn't like good. That. Last week's news articles were better. Yeah. You have more fun with those ones? Can I say, can I vote for Joseph if only because he's hated every single thing he's had to talk about today? <laughs> <laughs> like, I feel like if he wanted to talk His about life the life and the virtual life? <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, it's an, it's an important piece of news, but I feel like it, if Joseph didn't feel like he was forced to talk about it, he wouldn't have. Um, yeah... Stocks are cool, but... I will say my argument for why the stocks is bad is because both me and Jeremy yawned in the minute that you had to well, talk about Yawning stocks. is contagious. That's true. I but yawned right this... after it, too. Yeah. Jesse started it. Sure. I didn't think it was boring. All aboard the yawn train! <sighs> I just think yeah, it provides sure. interesting context yeah. for especially then afterwards yeah. talking about the Overwatch League. But also, nobody knows what any of the words you said mean. I don't no. either. And EA, EA went up 1%, Activision went up 1%, Tencent went down. Bitcoin. I think yeah. I'm putting Asher to number 3 or 4. Okay, that's fair enough. So what would you put 5? Jorge. Asshole. 
<laughs> Jorge, where, where would you put five? Oh, I would put the stupid stocks. Okay. Jesse? It's hard for me to say, but it would be between these two. Probably, probably controller news again. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I, I'd have to go stocks. Yeah. I'm with Jorge. I can, I can go stocks. Here for oh, a flip. Asher, what do you think? I did yawn almost to me, almost before you got to the first number you Jesse said. Jesse kind of uh, screwed you over there. By you yawning. did! <laughs> if he really hadn't did. yawned, I wouldn't have yawned, and then Joseph wouldn't have yawned. To be fair, I wouldn't have yawned if you said something mildly interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Should we say that Asher's, number, Asher's story is number five? Then? No! <laughs> Should we? Uh, all in favor of Asher's story being... Well, Jesse, you have the deciding vote now. The majority is... Well, he doesn't want to put it at five. I mean, I said four. Oh, but it's just a majority, right? I said four, but... Like, me and Jorge are on Team Duke, and <laughs> these two are on Team Stocks. I believe it's Duke Team. Yeah, Duke yeah, Team. Yeah, you did say vote. That was hot dookie. Oh, uh, why do I have to be... Oh, I don't like being the deciding vote. I'm going to say... I Okay, I'm going to say Stocks is last, but only because I think Asher has more potential in him, and I want to see him I want to see him grow I into see. that. It's a motivation. I think I was way more animated than Jorge or... Uh, okay, let me, let me just tell you, let me just tell you, Asher, <laughs> telling people that you're more animated them, <laughs> animated them only gets you in trouble in this segment. Can confirm from last week. <laughs> yes. So, okay, so we got I Stocks think, I think you did. Five. I think you did good for your first time. But I think that you can do better, and I want to see that from you. <laughs> okay, Jesse's yeah, with the second, second worst. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think Jesse's at four. He's oh, Asher's at four, going with the, the bitter no, vote. No, it's got to be Jorge at four. <laughs> it's I think it's the Duke at four. Yeah, Jeremy, what, are you, what are you leaning towards? I'd say Overwatch League. I think Overwatch League is really important. But you didn't but sell you it. So much you didn't give reasons why it was important. I did. I, I said it was the next big step. Well, we saw yeah, the big sports. MLS esports expansion as well this week, uh, with a bunch of teams going on there. They have a Vancouver team, which is pretty exciting. Overwatch, yeah, bigger game for sure. Overwatch is. But um, we haven't really heard much about how it was as a broadcast experience. Okay. Follow up. <laughs> Counter counterpoint. Would you say that the Overwatch League is less important? Than an old <laughs> controller. It's the Duke. That's a legendary <laughs> That's controller. Yeah, no, 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 no. Okay, all right. Can we establish something right now, quickly? Are we allowed to joke answer for this segment? What do you because mean? Absolutely you're not, not. You're not actually voting for the Duke. You're doing it ironically. We're being passionate. No, I care more about the Duke than yeah, Overwatch. It's nostalgic. League. It's not nostalgic. It's dumb. No. Also, it's... are we going to talk about Detective Pikachu? Well, he, I there's mean, nothing to talk about. I mean, <laughs> I can. This is really hard because all of yours sucked. Uh, <laughs> well, like, I was the only one that I like. Anyway, okay, anyway, let me bring up Nasdaq. Like you're my 85 year old grandfather. <laughs> only two of them. The third one was the Hong Kong stock exchange. Hey, well, let's vote, idiot. For which is number four? Well, hold on. No, no, no. Yeah. Who? What do you want it for? Jorge. Okay, Jorge. What do you want it for? Just this. Your hold on. Jorge is the swing vote here. I didn't. What? I didn't vote for you, what? and I voted for Asher. Oh, that's true. Okay, oh, I pick myself. Why? Nice. He's wise. <laughs> what are you doing? He's wise. You betrayed the Duke. <laughs> oh my! Okay, God. I picked Pikachu. No, Pikachu. That doesn't solve anything. Oh my goodness, Jorge! You had the. Are you right right voting for me? All right, he picked the Duke. Yeah, I can't. Do to us. So the Duke is out. That's for number four. Okay. Five stocks, four Duke. So we got three left. Wasn't last. Uh, we have HTC Vive Pro, Detective Pikachu, and Overwatch League. You can vote for this, I, by the way. Yeah, I yeah, really hate that Detective Pikachu was the best. It's not the best yet. No, yeah, we have to vote for number three. I think the Vive was the best. Oh, Jesse, what do you have at number three? See, there's there's promise to all three of them. I think all three of okay, them are very right. important. I think the whole, like, the citywide expansion... Is very important, um, and I think it's a it's a, like I said, it's a big step. I think Detective Pikachu is a very very fun and uplifting piece of news that we don't get to hear very much. I think that the HTC Vive is very very important, and uh, and, and, and another huge step in the world of virtual reality. Jorge, don't fall asleep on me. <laughs> but you're, this is a bit verbose. <laughs> this is my nickname in high school. I thought it was Everything Ocelot. I don't remember what we were talking about. What about that Rusty nickname that you said today? Oh, Rusty. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, don't, yeah, hey, Rusty. don't spoil anything. Don't spoil anything. 
from a video that I definitely was not in. You were in. It was called Let's. Uh, no, actually, I haven't decided what to call it because you guys played so poorly. I wanted to call it like idiots play near <laughs> automata or something, but that seems a bit harsh. No. No. Yeah, it's fair. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Jesse, what are you picking at number three? I think I have to go with Detective Pikachu because I feel yeah. like it's the least important piece of news. I'm I think not a that... fan of Ryan Reynolds in a big Hollywood movie playing yeah. uh, Sherlock Holmes Pikachu. Is oh that yeah, I'm really... a huge fan of that. <laughs> <Is> that <laughs> like it's it's cool. But I think that VR and the world of esports is more important than a game that is coming out for the 3DS and 2DS. I'm just saying there's going to be a giant statue of one thing on my desk. Not yeah. going to be the Vive or I'll agree with esports. That. I think Joseph should be number three. Okay, uh, Vive? Not because the Vibe is unimportant. I think it's... A it's Vive. Really big step. The Vibe is pretty important. Uh, <laughs> I, I get really good vibes more, off of it. He needs more crystals. Uh, but just... Joseph, I've never seen your voice change. I've never seen your face get excited. Yeah. And it no, makes I mean, me no. hard to put you at second. <laughs> okay. <Or> Excuse me, <laughs> sir. <laughs> All right. Um, I got to go Overwatch League. I feel like uh, I don't know enough about it. And I don't know how different it is from other Overwatch Leagues. Joseph, what do you think? Yeah, I'll, I'll see Jesse's at the bottom. Can I can I make one point for myself here? You made too many. I memorized those teams really quickly. <laughs> like, come on, guys, please. That means there's not enough teams. Like, I read the page for three seconds and I remembered all of them. I think that that deserves some sort of. But credit. they all play out of Los Angeles, so yeah, that's true. It's not real. But what about the Shanghai Knights? <laughs> that's uh -oh. not what they're called. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking of the movie Shanghai Knights. Uh, <laughs> wait, what do you say? <laughs> so there's two for Overwatch League, and one each for Pikachu, Pikachu and Vive. Well, you want to take Pikachu out? Is it really important? Oh, it's pretty important. It's your call. Like, he doesn't just say Pikachu. He has, like, a gruff voice, and he talks about crimes. But th that doesn't make it important. <laughs> uh, that's pretty important to me. I... It's 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 not like it's, like, a movie that we're talking about all the time. Like, this is the first time I've heard about Detective Pikachu in, like, a year. Where were you? There's huge buzz on the internet. Okay, well, clearly not on Detective Pikachu forums. <laughs> is there such a thing? I'll I go on. I, have no, I mean, I wouldn't know. I'm not on them. There's definitely that thing. Uh, do you think they're going to add Detective Pikachu to Smash Brothers? That's the real question. I think if they... Maybe use a skin for... If they ever port anything to the Switch. <laughs> if you, so never. If you <laughs> can... If you can show me footage... Or if you can show me, like... Fact. That he will be added to a Super Smash Brothers game... I will change my vote. Well, I don't care about your vote. You're outvoted anyway. Wait, what do you say? Pikachu... Okay. Oh, here we go. So uh, Asher has the yeah type because now it's two and two. He said mine. He said mine's number three. Yeah, yeah but, but yours doesn't have enough votes, so okay. you're free and clear. Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay, I Overwatch is my third favorite esport to watch, so it's hard for me to go against it. But also... There we go. There's always a problem. <laughs> <laughs> you never want to be said first. But also, I feel personally attacked by Jesse. Uh, <laughs> Why? <laughs> and yes. Detective That's Pikachu, it's not going to impact my life at all. I'm never going to watch it. I'm never going to play it. I'm going to look at the amiibo sometimes when I come over here. But is it really that important for me? I'm not going to watch the movie. So I'm definitely going to have to go with... <laughs> I can't bring myself... Jeremy, you're three. Oh, what a cruel betrayal of Ryan Reynolds' acting <laughs> career. Okay, so then what's next? Uh, we have to choose between Overwatch The Duke and finishes Live first! Pro. <laughs> wait, wait. So it's mine or yours, Jesse? Yeah. Okay. All right, so now we're voting for the best. What do you say, Warrior? Yours. Okay. He said it's so boring. Okay, Jesse's but, but it was interesting. One. It was it was I'm going Vive Pro. Yeah, I'm getting I'm live lost. There's no way I'm winning this now that he's been voted out. It's just you and me versus these three. Yeah. Immediately. Joseph. Like we don't even have to do a round. 
<sighs> Five Pro sure. could potentially change the landscape of video games by it, it can. by but Joseph's, virtual reality. I don't want Joseph to win two weeks in a row because <laughs> Joseph's really good at finding news. Yeah, he's <laughs> not. He didn't even you, find this news. You true. gave it to him. <laughs> you put he wanted to do. Lap. He wanted to do an offhanded quote from Donald E3 Trump. Games guy. <laughs> like it's not his news. Saying that Trump's comments uh, were. Not I think. Great. I think just the fact that it's not. The news that he wanted to bring to this table means that he should. Okay, be I first. have a proposal. What if I win with Vive Pro? Deal. Oh, yeah, I, I'll yeah, I'm really fine with that. With yeah. uh, could that also be that Joseph is not fifth, but he's he's, yeah, he's not six, counted? Six. Yeah. Well, he's third. I have to give him Detective Pikachu. Oh. Can I get Detective Pikachu and Joseph can take stocks? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'll trade you the Duke. No, I'll trade you. No, 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 hold on, hold on. I'll trade you for the Duke, and I'll give you Overwatch League. But in the future, you have to give me first pick on news. No, I like my Duke. So, do we have a decision here? You, win, I say, if Jeremy, if Jeremy can win with the HTC Vive and not Joseph, so HTC Vive part. Pro wins. Yeah, that's yeah. fine. I, that's a much better story than Overwatch League. I just don't want him Wait, to win that twice. Means in I a win row. two weeks in a row. No, you don't win. He wins. So oh, oh, by law, two weeks in a row. Trading not allowed. Joseph no. wins. No, what? No, 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 I did not vote for Joseph. Yeah, I voted for Jeremy. officially vote. Oh, man. Wow. There was, there was no Hold Jorge. Up, what do you pick? Joseph, what do you pick? There's none of that garbage. You're just a cheater and a liar in the face, sir. Well, you said we didn't need a vote because it was so obvious. Well, I guess it. So we're done. I would just have to say I just worked really hard for this. Well, congratulations. There's a lot of research. Yeah. See, you know what my least favorite part about all this is? Is I just looked at the screen and Joseph made tried to make eye contact with me five times while he said his concession <laughs> oh, speech because he knows how upset I'm going to get. Uh, wow. He didn't even pick it, man. That was a pretty vigorous battle of the news. But uh, thank you to all participants. Now oh, it's okay. time for the third segment. Oh, Wait, so I got second? Is it third segment? Yeah. How long is this? It's not that long. I forget what it's called, though. The weather. Uh, the, the forecast. All oh, right. The... Uh, Forecast. <laughs> I think that one needs. Going. I need to remember what it is. Uh, more plop 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 plop. I know, but what do we post? What else is there? Crackle, uh, crackle, pop, pop, oh, pop oh, do it. <laughs> okay. So <laughs> you did cereal though. Videos for the week. <laughs> Jesse, you started a new series with Joseph. What? With Joseph? <laughs> right? No, with yeah. Asher. Yeah, with oh, Asher. Asher. <laughs> there we go. I... <laughs> um... No. Um, Asher and I are... Near Automata. I like how he started the joke, but I'm not having any of it. We started playing Near Automata. Are we sticking with Idiot's Play, Near Automata? I, I think so. Idiot's Play is pretty funny. <laughs> okay. Uh, and it lives up to the name. Goofballs. I, I don't think we should go that high. Okay, <laughs> I don't think idiots. we're ready for it. Just idiots. <laughs> we, we shouldn't pretend like we're smart about it. <laughs> um, yeah. Asher, Asher's on the controls. Um, Not the most experienced with this genre. Or looking at a television for more than three seconds without glancing away. It's so easy to get distracted. You ever been... Never mind. We'll have that conversation after the podcast. Asher... Uh, Mom said I didn't need to go get tested. We took a look at the <laughs> Jackbox... <laughs> We played but another Jackbox game. We did. <laughs> well, I, wait, I went to talk about it? What's it called? <laughs> Jesse, why do you have uh, your shirt Faking it. Uh, <laughs> thanks for that cue card. I really appreciate that. Uh, we did! <laughs> <laughs> Joseph, get off your phone. We're on the podcast. Joseph has important things going on. Everybody's congratulating him about winning two weeks in a row. <laughs> yeah. Battle of the news. Exactly. Yeah, so we played faking it. Which is a t- Jackbox game where you pretend... I don't remember it at all. You was too busy playing chess. Asher was on it. Yeah, I'm way too sober for this. Again, second time. Me and, Jesse, second time. me and Jesse played Madden again. We did. Pretty exciting. His thumb uh, didn't hinder him as much, which is nice. I'm going down. Okay, I'm um, yelling hinder. Also, we did Jesse's favorite. NHL 3s. Oh, yes. Round 3. Yeah. The magic number. So, the big dilemma has been whether uh, 
Jesse was dragging down him and Joseph's partnership, oh, yeah. or whether Joseph was dragging it down. <laughs> so uh, this a, video I, solves all this. I have a question for after anything. the podcast. No, no, no. I won't ask it now, but as soon as we're done we recording, remind anything. me to ask you a question, Jeremy. We won't remember, remind me to ask you a question. But, um, Not him, you. There's a definitive answer given in this video, so yeah. make sure and check it out. And then uh, Jorge. Yes, sir. There's There'll be some more Batman going up. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, there was a slight echo issue in the first two episodes. I think I think we got that solved. But uh, solved for the third one. Okay. Yeah. Easy. Some did some good producer work. It was it was all Jesse. Oh wow! It's all Jesse. My what? assistant. I'm everyone. My, He's my, my right my <laughs> right hand man. I've been Batman for four Halloween. Wait, wait, wait! NBA. Uh, NBA. Uh, we don't have any yet, but we will oh. soon. Oh, okay. You're forgetting Hopefully. about the one other greatest game we ever played. Game. The, one on, the one on the phone. Oh, oh that's you. you. That's you. Uh, uh, we also played that to you. <laughs> that, which, that's pretty fun to watch. There's some stupid pictures of us. Yeah. I don't know why I looked at Jesse when I said that. That's just, you know, that's just what I did. Wow, that was a great forecast, guys. Because yeah. I'm the gross one. Can we can we do an outro with the noises as well? <laughs> oh, no, that's... <laughs> Is uh, that excessive? Well, could there be like an ending song? What do you want the outro to be, Jorge? I'll do it with you, so you don't have to do it by yourself because I know that you don't want to because you're nervous. I can do it by myself. Okay. Am I doing this like a song? No. Why did you do weather noises? <laughs> okay. No, no. I, I think an ending song would be really good. <laughs> <bad. laughs> <laughs> All right, Jorge. Do you know one? Of, do one of the old podcast songs. Oh, yeah. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and not miss an episode of the Dietrich Gamecast. Thank you everyone for watching. We'll see you next week. Peace. Keep the song going. I don't remember the rest. Just repeat that. How come every time I come around my lunch, I'm